What's up, my G's? We are here. We are on the way to the gym. It is 10:15. Got 45 minutes to get this workout in, but we're gonna get it. Gonna go hard for 30 minutes on the bench, chest, and then we're gonna hit the routine. I wanted to hit chest, shoulders, and triceps, but unfortunately, I was only able to get here or get here just now as when I'm gonna get there. Uh, I messed up on time today, but it's okay. Played Fortnite for the first time in three years. That was fun. I liked it. But now let's go get yoked. Continue to get ripped, my guy. I'm on shredding season right now. I'm shredding, and then I'm going to go on a bulk. Definitely don't want to lose the size that I have, but unfortunately, with any shred, you do, especially if you're not eating... I'm on, a, I'm on a cutting diet right now, so I'm losing some mass, but it's all good. Then we'll go back on a bulk, and we'll be doing that back and forth. So I want to be agile. It's the most important thing to me. Agile and strong. So it's a little grainy right now. It's just dark outside. It's so late. So I'll see you in the gym. We made it to the gym. Before we go in, we gotta get that young cologne in. Smell good, you know? I do it for myself, nobody else. Always like to smell good. Let's go. I was looking at a video earlier, and one of the comments read, oh, how do I find the motivation to go to the gym? And the reality is it's not motivation, it's discipline. I didn't want to come tonight. It's late. I'm tired. But we're still here. And that's called discipline. Nothing else. And the only way to get discipline is through vision. You need to envision yourself becoming that person that you're going to become by coming to the gym. It's the vision behind being here. That's it. Now, I, I have no interest in becoming no bodybuilder or nothing like that, but I do want to be in great shape, so I must be here. Hello, reps. The gym's gonna close in a little bit, so we gotta hurry up. I'll bust a couple of these sets. Let's see how many I can do. I'm not really sure right now. Let's see. I've probably done two more, but but I felt I felt a little I felt a little weak on that one. I just bust out ten reps on the other one. You're slowly getting stronger. You know, I ain't the biggest guy here or in any gym, but I'm slowly getting stronger. My chest has always been the weakest part of my body, and luckily I've been able through consistency been able to build it. To a nicer form, but really, all you need to get in shape is 30 minutes a day. That's why I came. That's all you really need. It's consistent, consistent. It's consistency that that sets you apart from anything. You come one day, you spend three hours, and never come back. Then another three months go by, you do the same thing. You ain't nowhere. But if you do it, come every every day for 15 minutes. 
30 minutes. You know, we really don't have time. 15 minutes is fine, but 30 minutes should be the minimum. And you'll see way better results. Even if just doing push-ups at home, man. That's all that really matters. Let's do one more, one more rep on this one. I just recently hit my 325 rep. And then I had to take a, a long break from the gym. I still kept doing my push-ups, doing 500 push-ups a day, but it still kind of deters me from, from being able to push this weight. All right, let's get one more rep in. Okay, two more. We just got the call from uh, the voiceover in the store in the in the gym that they're closing soon. So I've only been here for about twenty minutes. You know, out of that, I've probably worked out fifteen. You know, pushing heavy weights. But this goes to prove that's all you really need to get your workout in. I'm going to use the last 10 minutes. I could have used pushing reps to do the workout that I'm supposed to do every day because that's what I'm doing right now. Six-pack abs in 30 days on Instagram and uh, on YouTube. I'm posting the progress there, but that's really all you need. So the remaining 10 minutes of the gym opening, I'm going to do my workout. That goes to show it's just consistency. That's all it takes. That's all you need. So let's get this workout. I'm out of the gym. If you're watching this video and you're struggling to find the motivation, I would urge you to reframe that thought into discipline. Discipline is what's gonna get you what you want and vision. Why are you going to put yourself through pain and suffering? Who are you going to become after that? That's how you get disciplined. And I would urge you is to prove yourself as a man. I would urge you to try to be able to defend the ones you love in due time. I would urge you that it'll help you gain respect when you walk in a room. There's a lot of reasons why you would do it. So reframe your thought from motivation to discipline. And then You'll do it whether you feel motivated or not, whether you feel like going or not. You'll be disciplined and you're, you're going to do it. Reframe your mind.